Today is our senior thesis presentation and we have the Culinary Science Advisory Board coming. Quite a few of them are alum and it's going to be great just to see what they have to say about our projects and hopefully learn a little bit about them. I thought that all the students did a really good job and, and really had some really interesting research topics because often I think one of the hardest things in science is to come up with ideas to research. I mean, they're talking about molecules interacting with cells and how this, they can change this in a product and how they can change something else in another product. It was very interesting to see the different questions different people with different backgrounds asked me because it completely separated into two. There was one on looking at the caramelization of sugar, whether you started with it wet versus whether it was dry, and it came to some very clear conclusions, and it was really a great design and set up to be able to develop recipes, and I think that's what this student really wanted to go towards in that direction. There are strong, thoughtful from science program, culinary arts program, culinary science programs out there, but we pride ourselves on doing something very unique, because we believe the chef or the baker's voice and the technical scientist, scientific voice should be at the same table when we're doing experiments. But part and parcel of the experience here at the CIA is that notion of developing your palate. It's very good. It's, it's good to see people who are so prominent in the industry come in and talk to us. Yeah, I teach at the School of Health, uh, the Nutrition Department, a course on food science and technology at, at Harvard. I started off being a line cook. I went on to being a pastry chef. I went on to doing market research where I'm in now with consumer packaged goods. So I started at PepsiCo eight years ago. When I started uh, Research Chef as a, as a career path, it was relatively new. So I'm getting their feedback, I'm getting that professionalism, I'm understanding how this even ties into their industry. Some of the most valuable things they can take away from their thesis project is the idea of the scientific method and research. And this is really what goes into developing products at a larger scale for large consumer packaged goods companies or even national chains for restaurants. So culinary science is a discipline, provides additional knowledge, background, technique that you wouldn't find in a traditional food science. The world of culinary science and this career path is a new path. So the CIA is literally pioneering a new program uh, it, 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 it's not that they can look at the competition and see what the competition's doing because no one's doing it. And there certainly isn't another culinary school that can provide what the CIA provides. They know how to go out there and take all these tools that they have learned and say, I'm ready. 